Hey y'all, Rainy Day Stitcher here, long time no see. Uh, I know I am so long overdue for a floss tube. Um, I ended up taking the summer off and then this semester has been one thing after another. So I'm really hoping to get one uh, shot and posted this weekend. But in the meantime, my advents are coming in. Woo! So um, as promised, uh, I'm going to do like a Flossoween daily opening of my advent. So today is October 1st. We'll do, you know, the, the first days. So clearly not articulate. It's been a long day after a long week, after a long month. I know I'm not alone in that. Um, I have three advents that have showed up. There have been some hiccups with my stitchy box and my fangirl fibers um, yarn box but those will be here soon and I'll catch you up but in the meantime we have two cross stitches boxes and one yarn so the first one let's do the black needle society uh, what are they calling it trick-or-treat so this came in so much adorable packaging so we've got this little guy, here we go, day one, what could it be, what could it be, feels flat, oh this is cool, it's like one of those corner, like sort of corner start guides, um, with a Ouija board, uh, that is, that is seriously cool, so let's, you know, they do the little card with the scratch off, so let's scratch off and see what the description is. I'm learning. I can't read this without looking close. So in the future, I can scratch it off in before. So it says, a three-inch square um, bowl. I don't have enough. <laughs> Start your Halloween projects off right with this handy corner measuring tool um, by Doodle by Meg. So it's very cool. It has a has a Ouija board and I, I love it. I don't have a corner start square. So that's very cool and a great way to start the Halloween countdown. The next one I have is my Fangirl Fibers uh, Haunted Mansion uh, Halloween countdown. So it came with this really cute illustrated art of one of the mansion workers. And October 1st is in this manila envelope. I'm going to guess it's some sort of pattern. Oh, okay. So I can't show it to you all because it's like pages of the pattern. Um, I don't have, I don't know what it's going to look like. Um, but we have, we're starting off with a floss list and some info. I'm not going to show the pattern, but I'm going to look and see if I can get a sense of what it is. Okay, so it sort of looks like maybe one of the, if you know the Haunted Mansion, the, um, the tombs and cenotaphs outside. It sort of reminds me of that. So, Okay, that is very cool. I don't know if these are going to go together, like interlock, or if they're all independent. We'll kind of have to, we have to figure this out. So then my third one is by Dragon Horde Yarn, and this is um, dark crystal themed. So here's day number one. Let's see if I'm looking at all these adorable little bags, and ooh, it's so squishy! Oh, and I meant to watch the Dark Crystal show on Netflix, and I keep falling asleep, so I may not know what this is. Um, it says Vapra. I don't remember what Vapra is. Um, but it is this beautiful, like, light blue with dark blue and teal speckles. This is gorgeous. So, oh, I'm so excited, and I can't wait to see what I get to open tomorrow. So, um, I'm going to go ahead and sign off, but... Um, I will see you soon with more things to open. Bye, everybody.